Right now, it's six, the Delta variant is derailing return to work plans in Uptown. Now, some of the city's largest employers are pushing back when staff can return to the office. Fox 46's chief business correspondent Taylor Young shows us the impact it will have on the Queen City. Some of Charlotte's workers say they were ready for foot traffic and lines at cafes during lunch in coming weeks, but now are preparing to potentially pack up their office and work from home. Everyone had this idea of just in the next month or so, everything would be back to normal. The majority of offices that look down on Uptown's busy streets are still vacant. It's gotten more busy as the year has progressed, but um, it's still completely not back. Wells Fargo originally planned to bring employees back into its corporate offices September 7th. The bank says it now plans to begin the first phase of its return to work schedule in early October. Truist Bank is also pushing the return date for the majority of its staff from October to November. I think it's better if people start coming back just for to, to support the businesses, to get everyone back in so that there's um, uh, just there are too many places that rely on the corporates coming back. Last month, Bank of America said the majority of its staff would return to Uptown shortly after Labor Day and staff would be given a 30 day notice. An employee with the bank tells Fox 46 they have not yet received any notice. I definitely think that it's kind of needed at least kind of for like a little bit right now just because I mean from what I've heard the numbers are getting worse some people's conditions are getting worse. Nick Elia just landed his first job in Charlotte's Uptown and fears he could be returning home any day now. It just seems like within the past like two weeks we're doing a complete 180 everyone's starting to go home and I think it's just kind of crappy for some especially someone as young as me like this is my first job I'm kind of getting into things and I kind of got the whole office feel of everything and now I'm getting sent back to remote and it's just it's definitely not something I'm looking forward to. While all the banks we spoke with today say they are highly encouraging their staff to get vaccinated, none of them are mandating it at this time. Reporting in Uptown, Taylor Young, Fox 46.